currently testing out a Google Chrome extension called vidIQ. While it is free, I'm using a paid version of it. I realized I should make a video about vidIQ, even if it's a YouTube-centric topic. I'm sure someone will find this video helpful. So let's dive in and see what vidIQ has to offer the many content creators out there. vidIQ is a website that provides video tutorials and analytics on YouTube channel growth. Users can also analyze YouTube's analytic data using the website's Google Chrome or Firefox extension. vidIQ is frequently compared to TubeBuddy, which is an alternative platform with similar features to vidIQ. They also have a very active YouTube channel, which they use to update the viewers on what is going on with YouTube. vidIQ also has been verified by YouTube after passing the YouTube certification program. The first step is to go to vidIQ.com, create an account, and download the extension for Google Chrome or Mozilla Firefox. They have a basic plan that's free. This gives you a taste of what vidIQ could offer. Then there is the Pro plan, followed by the Boost plan, and finally the Max plan. On their website, they recommend the Boost plan. To get more analytics and research keywords, you'll need to at least be on Pro. Boost promises increased views, and the Max plan gives you access to group coaching. As for vidIQ's pricing options, the basic plan as previously said, is free and serves as an introduction to YouTube. They also promise to be able to help with premium plans that start at $50 per month and can go up from there. The next price tier is $79 per month, which is slightly more expensive than the first. It's not all bad news. They have a more wallet-friendly $7.50 monthly plan, following the free one. So you have a broad variety of pricing to pick from base on your budget. There is a lot to like about vidIQ. Anything that can help content creators grow on YouTube is always a good thing. In my opinion, the keyword research tool is the reason why you should get the pro plan. If you need help with search engine optimization, the CEO title and description recommendations are why you should choose the Boost plan. All paid plans will give you email and chat, which is always good. Also on the plus site is the daily ideas. This should help you with ideas for a few videos for your channel. VidIQ's daily ideas are much better than YouTube's own alternative. VidIQ's website and web browser extensions work extremely well and very reliable. I did not have a single issue. There are two major issues with vidIQ. Outside of the Pro plan, the other options are incredibly expensive. And I'm afraid to say it cannot be justified in the current economic situation. If you have a large YouTube channel bringing in lots of income, then yes, it may still be justified. If you're a small or medium-sized content creator, I would find it extremely hard to justify the more expensive plans. The other major issue is limited support for web browsers. Currently, the extension only works on Google Chrome and Mozilla Firefox. So that means you may have to use your least preferred web browser. I would also like to add that some features may be less useful to certain content creators depending on their experience. I think vidIQ is a useful tool for YouTube content creators. Even the basic plan offers something for everyone. I would highly recommend the pro plan as I think it offers enough upgrades over the basic plan and does not cost the earth. If you don't mind spending a little more, the boost plan has a few useful upgrades. These upgrades can help you with Search engine optimization for video titles, video descriptions, and, and dedicated CEO analytics.
thumbnail previews are also a useful upgrade feature as well. Don't worry too much about YouTube tags. They play a minimum role in helping viewers find your video. Final thoughts? I would recommend vidIQ. You can easily start with a free version and then see if you want to upgrade later. After using their boost plan, I'm left quite satisfied with vidIQ.